Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Back with some more Gotham Knights gameplay for you. And last time I left off, I had just encountered a penguin. Had to do a few things to convince the penguin to talk. But the reason why he wasn't talking wasn't because of me, most likely. is because he's afraid. He's afraid because he's being watched by the Court of Owls. Who I'm really excited to see how they're incorporated into this game. And the whole legend and myth about them. And I'm about to go to the Powers Club. But Alfred is also out and about. So I gotta check on Alfred. Because, you know, we can't have anything happen to Alfred. But... Alfred is a badass mofo, so he probably can hold his own. Without further ado, let's get into it. And I also got this new way of traveling, my fast travel system, which I think is really cool. Coming in a little bit in style, but a lot easier to get around the city instead of traveling long distance way. But let's get in there. Colonel Kane. Sergeant Pennyworth. I'm sorry I had to push our meeting so late. Work never seems to stop in this city. Oh, I can certainly relate. The paperwork hasn't let up since Bruce's passing. <sighs> yeah. I still can't believe it. Burying Bruce was the hardest thing I've ever done. Yeah. Do you remember what I told you after Martha and Tommy? You said, life matters when death matters. We take the living for granted until they're gone. I don't know what the Wayne Foundation will do without Bruce. I trust Master Grayson has been helpful? As you adjust? Yeah, he sure has. Dick had his first investor call the other day. I'm surprised how well he did. Every day I find... You geezers escape from the old folks' home. Don't you know it's dangerous out here at night? Every day I find new reasons to be proud. Empty your pockets or I empty the gun. I'll think about that. You know what? Never mind. Hey, you better <laughs> run. <laughs> he ain't gonna fuck with these two guys. Quite the about face. That punk didn't know who he was messing with. <laughs> Come inside. We'll have a drink. Catch up. Don't have to twist my arm. Let's not be long, though. I wouldn't want anyone to worry. All right, Belfry. What do you have on the court? The Court of Owls legend dates back to the founding of Gotham. According to the poem, there's supposed to be a secret society that controls the city from the shadows. I remember reading about them when I was a kid. But why would Penguin send us after an old story? If the court exists, and they're as powerful as they claim, they might be behind all the prisoner releases from Blackgate. And whoever's doing that has been getting away with it for centuries. Copy that. Let's hope a visit to the Powers Club leads somewhere. I remember the first time I ever read anything about the Quarter of Owls. I think that was right around when I actually first started reading comic books. I started reading in 2012, um, and that was that. Um, Belfry, I'm at the Powers Club. I can't what remember the run on it, but that house is at least a century it was pretty old epic run. Who knows how many renovations? The blueprints we have on file are catastrophically out of date. 
which means I have no idea what's inside. Perfect. My dad always thought there was something shady about the Powers Club, but he could never prove anything illegal was going on there. Unfortunately, Gotham's elite has a knack for having their hands clean at the right time. <laughs> then it's a good thing they don't know I'm coming. But yeah, that run on the Court of Owls, it was, um... It was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Just have something different, have another cool villain concept come into the fray of Batman. Because you know, Batman does have overall the greatest road gallery, so... It's cool to see something new and different and be successful at it, so... I'm going to see how this is going to go down. I'm in. Time to see what the 1% does in its spare time. Good. Be careful and let us know what you find. Gotham by Gaslight. Not a crazy fan of that, but you know, it's, it's different. It's alright. their own security. They told you to take an extra long lunch too, huh? I'm not complaining. I have to get a break once in a while. So what do you think the poor bastard did? The poor bastard. As far as I know, I just got along the break. That doesn't sound good. Can get a closer look. AR picked up traces of that blood trail. Let's see what else it can find. There's something underneath the floor. Looks like it's hooked up to some sort of network. Must be a way to activate it. Of course, it's got to be a bust. Well, obvious, don't you think? They said we'd be working at a club. This isn't exactly what I had in mind. It's a gentleman's club. Whatever that means. Just saying, I was hoping for something a little more clubby and a little less freaky. Shut up. It's easy money. We barely have to feed the knobs anyway. Yeah, what the hell's that about? Who cares? The less we know, the better. Looks like things. 
Yeah. Why security so tight lately? Who knows? Big wigs with big money want to feel important. See shit. Come on, make your mind. What are you gonna do? Is that all he's gonna do? <laughs> Over. I didn't think I was going to get to him, but... I don't know if they're going to come back and that they are moving. These guys. He's facing the wall. Okay. What's this dude doing? Okay, I think I know how I'm going to take them down. That dude's facing the wall. He's just facing that wall. And this dude's just. Yeah, wait till he comes back. Barbara Jeffrey does like using her thighs, but hey, we're not complaining.
It's a key thing holding it now. <laughs> Got it. I wonder if we did that um, when they were awake, what would they have done, the guards? get up there. No. Interesting. Where is that going towards? <laughs> that hair? There we go. What a waste of a good book. Bingo. staircase can't be the only thing they're hiding okay I'm gonna run a lot more than that Belfry got a secret stairwell here I'm heading down Belfry something's jamming the signal Enable logging mode. Send as soon as possible. 
It's not good. Definitely more to this than meets the eye. Hmm, there's got to be more to this room. Another exit, maybe. That did something. is watching from inside of Gotham's walls. I remember that mask. Oh no, not you! Oh shit. Telling the truth. The court of owls is no myth. They're real. Let's see what we got. Does this rabbit hole go? Assured your bill will pass early next month. Wonderful. I, I abhor dealing with filth. 
I'm sorry, man. We need to get you to safety. Scary little fuckers scratching at the walls. They're all soft. That dog creeps me out. <laughs> No other way but through them. No one gets through. The ceremony can't be delayed. You don't need to tell me that twice. This is our chance to impress the voice. Kill the intruders first. Then you can think about it. Hey, I see back from <laughs> This is a joke of a fight. <laughs> you crossed the wrong people. <laughs> Oh yeah, you better run. You better run. God damn. Sure, ass. Who's out there? So much blood. We need to get to him fast. Hey, shit. That must be the man they took. Oh, 
I, that was my own fault. I ran right this out of it. Well, that was just stupid. <laughs> Oh man. God, there must be hundreds of victims here. This jacket looks like it's from at least the 1800s. <clears throat> the court has been killing people for centuries. Oh yeah, they're old. They're old as shit. <laughs> Sleeves like this were all the rage in the early 1900s. This looks promising. Glad to have you back online. What happened? Are you all right? I'm okay. Mostly. But I... I don't even know how to describe what just happened. I'll fill you in when I get back. Copy that. See you soon. Yeah. How the hell do I get out of here? Well, that was quite an experience, but... But yeah, basically, the, um... Border Owls is a... old secret society, and... They've been, they're basically old as shit, like, and that whole run on that comic run I was mentioning earlier was just really epic, just cool, just to know that these guys have been there the whole time, and, you know, Batman and nobody really even knew about their existence, which is crazy, because it's like, you know, it's Batman, but, yeah, I guess it's fast travel, Let's see what goes on here. I don't think there should be anything else, but yeah, this is okay. Oh, yeah, she's oh well. Touch on him later. Yeah, man. Or it's never done in this damn city. Yeah, smiley face. <laughs> Did you know that Bruce was looking into the court? I didn't. There were few things he kept from me, but this was unfortunately one of them. For me too. We managed to log some voice recordings of the court, but they're difficult to make out. You sure? You just forget they had play. Tim. You know, you weren't the first Robin kid. Or the second. A bunch of files got corrupted. I'll run some diagnostics, see what I can recover. 
Let's see if Master Bruce left us any more clues. Margie, the tattooed lady, would tell us stories about the court back at Haley's Circus. He used to say they were watching and they'd steal us away if we gave a bad performance. Always assumed it was just circus legend. Not at all. There are a number of references to the court in Gotham's history, but nothing concrete. I can't authenticate any of these sources. Supposedly some wingnut wrote a tell-all book about them. But it's a legend in and of itself, so... Shame, really. Such a work would have made a wonderful addition to the library. The earliest version of the court rhyme is from the 1700s. And says they're after the Fountain of Youth. <laughs> Seem pretty kill-happy for people who want eternal life. Those aren't mutually exclusive. There were a lot of bodies in that pit. And one of them was holding this. Might open something useful. Our scans revealed an isotope embedded in the metal. It definitely has a match. It's a key. So, let's find the door. <laughs> Got new intel for the evidence board. Up too. All right, but yeah, so we discovered the Court of Owls. And just quick question: What was your guys' first encounter with the Court of Owls? Was it like me with the um, their debut and their issue? It says right around when I first started reading comic books, and thought that was cool as shit. Because ironically enough, I think I really started reading comic books. I think it came because of after playing Arkham City, because I grew up. Um, watching the animated series of Batman and the cartoons and the movies, but when I played Arkham City, that's where I um, was very fascinated by the um, Hush. That was the first time I ever met Hush in City, and from that, I was like, man, maybe I need to read comic books because some characters I've never seen before. He obviously was a more of a newer character, but my point was it got me to read comic books, and one of my first things was that 2011-2012 run on Batman, um, I think around the New 52 run, but it was just really good. And it started out with the Court of Owls, and that was just an excellent story. The whole run was pretty solid. I really enjoyed that. I own some of the um, comics of that. But let me know what you think about the Court of Owls and stuff. Is that a villain group you like? Is it something you enjoy or whatnot? Because it's always cool to have new characters be introduced, whether they're heroic or villainous. But that is going to be it. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to jump on my next video and hope like i see you guys later thanks for watching i hope you enjoy the rest of your day peace